Hi everyone and welcome to the channel. Before we get started, please consider subscribing to my channel and possibly becoming a Patreon. Now this is a short video for Radio Master Zura users. Now if you're a beginner, you may not know that you can make custom sounds for your radio. So you may have noticed in some of the videos I'm using sounds, you may have tried to find them on your, uh, in your sound uh, folder and you can't find them. That's because I made the sounds myself. Now I'm not going to redo the video uh, for this because I do have an OpenTX video which shows you how to do this, how to uh, make the sounds and what parameters you have to use to make them and how you produce the sounds. So I'm going to put a link in the description below. This is just an informative video for anybody who's new to the hobby and new to using their Zora radio. So there's a link, go and click that link, it will show you how to make the sounds, which I actually quite enjoy. Um, I did one recently for a bomb drop and the first flick of the switch says bomb drop initialized and it starts making a siren. Drop bay primed. And then uh, the next one, when you click the switch again, it says bomb drop. Now I enjoy, I enjoy doing that. And also there is a sound pack called Amber. Now, um, Amber is a, a sound pack that's been made by, I think, the OpenTX, someone connected to OpenTX. We're going to have a look at the computer in a minute and I'll show you where to download it. Now, what you need to do is if you want to use it, you download the Amber pack. You have to, it's a raw file, so you need a, a, a certain type of a program to unzip it. You unzip it and then you copy it into your directory. Now, as far as I know, it's only in English, so you would copy those files into your um, sounds folder and then you will overwrite them and you'll come up with the new sounds. Now I haven't tried directly doing this uh, to an HTX radio because I think it will rub out the file, the system file saying welcome to HTX, but I'm not sure. So what I'm doing, I'm not copying the system uh, files over, I just copy all the other ones in the main directory or the main folder of the sound card. So let's take a look at the computer and I'll show you where to get your Amber sounds from. Now we need to go to this web page and you can see it's the OpenTX University and the Amber Pack is here, Amber Sound, Amber Sound Pack version 2.2. You can click there, I'm going to click and it will start downloading and we're going to download the pack. Let me go through this process and show you it quickly. And as you can see, it's a raw file, so we're going to need a specific program to be able to unzip it. So let's go and have a look at the folders. So here's the download. Now if I double click this, it's going to launch the program that I used to do this, which is called pzip. Um, so what you would do is you're going to, well, we can actually go back. Let's go back in there again. You can go in, into here and you can just unzip this. Once you've unzipped it, all you're going to do is, let, let's actually, let's extract it. There'll be links in the description below to all the uh, sites you need to go to to get the programs that you need to do this. Okay, so we're going to close this. So if we go into sounds, now all you'll do is go into here, select all these sounds. Now, if you're, uh, if you're using HTX, I would, wouldn't copy the system file here. Just copy all of these. So you're gonna click there, invert selection, say copy, and then go to your SD card where, you know, for your radio. This is, this is the uh, folder on my computer. Double click, go into English, uh, and then right click and paste and that's it. Now you've got the amber sounds on your radio. Now once HTX start getting uh, matching SD cards for different, for different um, versions, there'll be a, a different way to do this. But at the moment, um, this is how we would, would do this. So if you found this video useful, please give it a thumbs up. And if you didn't, give it a thumbs down. If you have comments or questions, please leave them in the comments section below because I'd love to hear from you. And don't forget, all the links are in the description below if you'd like to get the Make Custom Sounds and also if you'd like to use the Amber Pack. Thanks for watching. Happy flying. Bye for now.